Wells Fargo will pay a total of $575 million to every state and the District of Columbia to settle lawsuits related to, in part, creating millions of fake accounts. In September of 2016, the bank admitted to creating more than 3 million fake bank and credit card accounts without customers' knowledge or consent. Employees said they felt pressured to do so to meet the company's sales goals. In a statement, Wells Fargo's CEO said the agreement underscores its, quote, serious commitment to making things right in regard to past issues as we work to build a better bank. Since April, the bank has paid at least $2 billion in fines related to various issues, including investigations into its mortgage and auto loan practices. Practices. Because of these scandals, the Federal Reserve has restricted the bank's growth until it's satisfied Wells Fargo has taken the appropriate steps to clean up its act.